Another thing about uni is the structure of life. So if you, you know, if you leave high school and you're kind of just wanting to have some satisfaction of your life and where you're going, um, you know, it's hard to figure out where your goals are and if you're hitting them. But when you come to uni, you can see your progress on black and white paper of how well you're doing in life. That's Even if you say like, oh, I didn't do much today. I just did homework. You could just say, oh, you know, I learned how databases work, sort of thing. Just wasn't expecting such a good peer network mm. coming into it. And you know, compared to like a high school environment, when you come into here, it's you know, everybody supports each other, sort of thing. Because it's self-directed learning. Yeah, At the end yeah, of the day, true. you're paying to study this, mm. yeah. um, and you've chosen to study this. So, yeah, if you want to do it, then you're going to show up to classes, you're going to show up to lectures, you're going to get excited about the assignments. If you don't want to be doing it, then why are you paying the money to be here? Pretty yeah. much. Workload. Everyone's like uni's chill. You have much more time, but that's not true. Really? No. You got a lot of studies to get done. Yeah. Um. But apart from that, you have your own free time here and there. You don't have to go to classes like eight to five, eight to five every day. Yeah. So that's pretty cool. There's a lot of different uh ways to study. Like uh, you can either just do it externally or you know go to lectures. There's a lot of options for you to that suit your style of learning, I guess. As well, like. As the like semester goes on and the assignments start stacking on, people tend to use the like online lectures and stuff a lot more. Like as it goes through, so you learn as you progress through your degree. I know that's definitely that's what I've done. Yeah, yeah. I feel like I've been friends with people in my unit, and then afterwards I haven't really kept much yeah. contact with them. It's also easy to transfer if you don't like what you're studying. Also, yeah. Mm -hmm. Cool. So the level of freedom you just don't get in high school. The importance of time management. Yeah, shit. <laughs> Goodness me. <laughs> it makes all the difference, it really does. Yeah. But definitely easier said than done. I think I was surprised by how much it was just you being very independent. Like you just pick your own subject, you're enrolled in the classes you want. It's just you doing what you want. It's so easy to not go to a lecture and then you can just fall so far behind and and that you say you'll catch up but then you never do. But the tutor's like really good so it encourages you to do the work but then some other tutors can be like pretty bad so you don't really put in much as much effort. Sure. But yeah, I think that the tutor does like have a quite big impact on how much work you're going to put into the subject. So you can basically choose the days that work best for you and you can study on those days so it makes it easy to work, yeah. um, play sport, that sort of thing. Another thing about uni is the structure of life. So if you, you know, if you leave high school and you're kind of just wanting to have some satisfaction of your life and where you're going, um, you know, it's hard to figure out where your goals are and if you're hitting them. But when you come to uni, you can see your progress on black and white paper of how well you're doing in life. That's Even if you say like, oh, I didn't do much today. I just did homework. You could just say, oh, you know, I learned how databases work, sort of thing. I find that. Compared to the rigorous and stressful environment of, say, high school, yeah. it's a lot more relaxed. Um, it is a lot more self-motivated, which is um, which I quite like. Um, but I, I find that um, it's a completely different environment to what I thought. I was petrified that it was going to be like high school over again, and it wasn't. Yeah. Do you look at the unit outlines or um, the course? guidebooks and yeah. they're like do this do this do this yeah. but when you actually talk to a unit coordinator they're like oh no you don't have to do that one there's something else you can do or if you're like if you need help they're actually quite helpful they're not as rigid as high school for example teacher and student relationships they speed feed you a lot more like when it comes to assessments they give you all the resources they give you all the content that you need to go to write your essays or do your tests but here at university you have to have your own own initiative and independence to go out and find that resources you've got to be very proactive from the outset like you know everything in high school right. is pretty much spoon fed to you and I could not tell you one thing I learnt in the first semester you just because it all was just crammed the week before the exams because you know there's no one telling you do this do that nice. remember this remember that I just love uni life to be honest like I, I am in no rush to apply for industry jobs or graduate programs or anything like I'm loving uni life I think it's really good <laughs>